Welcome back. A startup is turning $480 million in federal funding into the nation's first sustainable battery recycling plant. It's underway in Kentucky, and Diana Olick is there to bring us the details. Hi, Diana. Hi, Kelly. That's right. Going up behind me is nearly 1 million square feet of production facilities to recycle EV battery materials, ultimately enough to power 750,000 batteries per year. Deep in Kentucky farm country, a green economy is taking root. EV battery recycling company Ascend Elements is investing about a billion dollars, building a half million square foot manufacturing plant, North America's first sustainable battery cathode production facility. It's urban mining, in effect, that we're collecting batteries from the field and bringing them back in and, and making new battery materials out of them. Construction started sooner than expected when Ascend received two grants totaling $480 million from the bipartisan infrastructure law. The facility will employ up to 400 people and, according to Ascend, generate up to $4.4 billion in economic impact to Kentucky over the construction period and the first 10 years. The fact that we are getting a certain amount of uh, government support in, in building a facility like this has really also helped catalyze some of the investors, the private money that is coming in. Last month, Ascend announced it had raised $542 million of new funding, one of the largest U.S. clean tech private equity raises this year. It was led by decarbonization partners. Make no mistake, these are heavy lifts, and to, to finance companies like Ascend Elements is going to take all kinds of capital. Now, in addition to infrastructure funding, there is also money in the Inflation Reduction Act, the IRA. That is a tax credit to automakers who use recycled batteries if those batteries are made in the U.S. So, guys, this is what you call technically a government funding double whammy. Yep, big deal for automakers who want to qualify for subsidies and also a big deal for the surrounding area, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. I spoke with the Area Chamber of Commerce, and he called this, quote, a game changer. He said not just the jobs coming in, but the upgrade to area roads and utilities, child care, et cetera. So it's really going to change this whole area. And I might also wanted to mention that we profiled Ascend Elements in our Clean Start series right here on Power Lunch. A year and a half ago, back then, it was a $95 million company. Now, over a billion, it is our first Clean Start unicorn, Kelly. Wow. Diana, thank you so much. We appreciate bringing that to us today, Diana Olek.